All right, everyone's favorite inelastic collision. Here we have two train cars uh, that are actually traveling toward each other. This one has a mass of 10,000 kilograms and a velocity of five meters per second in that direction. This train car here has a mass of 15,000 kilograms, so it's a little bigger, uh, and it has a velocity of two meters per second in the other direction. So these two train cars are traveling towards each other. They're going to collide and link together. That's what makes it an inelastic collision, the fact that they're linked by the end of it. So uh, what's our equation for this? Well, here it is. Um, M1 times velocity initial plus M2 times velocity initial. Of course, this is M1 and this is M2. And I always like to write this so that uh, everything's lined up. And then we have the collision. That's what this blob is. And then we're going to make a uh, parentheses and say M1 plus M2. We're adding their masses together because they become one object times some final velocity. Okay, so how do we do this? Well, we've got to just multiply the mass of this times the velocity. And uh, I'm just going to do it. It's 10,000 times 5. I know that's 50,000 uh, kilogram meters per second. And added to uh, negative 2 meters per second, because it's going this way, times 15,000, that's going to be negative 30,000 uh, kilogram meters per second. And we're going to add these masses together. Uh, so M1 plus M2, that's 10,000 plus 15,000, is going to be 25,000 kilograms. And that times the final velocity for both cars stuck together is going to be our answer. So 50,000 plus a negative 30,000 gives us 20,000 kilogram meters per second. And that equals uh, 25,000 VF. Okay, so now we're going to subtract both sides by 25,000. I'm sorry, subtract them and divide both sides by 25,000. And uh, this looks like it's going to be about um, 0 0.8. 20 over 25, that's just like 4 over 5, which is 0 0.8. So VF equals 0 0.8 meters per second. That's how fast these two cars will be going after they link together, after they've crashed when one was going one way, one was going the other way. Notice that they're going in this direction because the velocity is positive. This one was, had a little more momentum coming into the collision than this one, even though this one had a bigger mass. The result is that both cars link together and travel more slowly in this direction at a rate of about 0.8 meters per second. Okay? Inelastic collision.